What is going on YouTube? Welcome to today's video. As you saw by the title, this is going to be a try on, a haul for Alphalete. We have a launch coming up this Saturday, which is I think November 7th. So super, super pumped for that. I'm joined here by my trusty assistant and steed, Elon. So he's saying hello. Um, so if you plan to get anything, please use um, uh, Hanasty, Head Nasty, uh, as the referral code and that will see one well, that doesn't save anything um, But it does support me and helps Elon get more treats as you see we got duck boots over there and some trail treats But to the piece de resistance of this video um, Really cool launch coming up I like doing these videos when it's kind of like a bigger launch and if you can see by this box It's a it's a pretty 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 hefty launch That was pretty heavy to bring over um, so we're going to be getting right into this. Some of this stuff has already dropped as of Monday, whatever yesterday's date was, I think it was the second. So they dropped the collective tee and the training tights. Um, and I'm just going to show you what those look like. My measurements and my sizes, 6'2", 225. And then I think we have the majority of my measurements here. Just retook some of them. Quads are now 26.5. I think chest is around 45. And uh, arms. As of the pump I got this morning are now uh, 17 and a half, which is pretty sweet, but going for the 18s, but we will see how that one goes. Um, so we're going to start off with the things that have dropped yesterday, which is going to be the collective T. I can also show you. I'll put them on first, collective T and the training tights. Let's put those on. All right, so got it on here. So we got the training tights. So they don't have too much of an issue. I mean, I think they're... They feel kind of thin, but I think they're thick enough so you don't have that mushroom tip problem, which is good because some people don't sign up for that when they're at the gym just trying to lift. Um, and the shirt, pretty stretchy. It um, has a pretty good snug fit, so I'll keep it 360. Got these. So these are pretty cool. I think these are ones a lot of people like wearing them under shorts. They're not super, super smooth where you're going to slide your knee sleeves like right up. There is still a little bit of friction when you're pulling up your knee sleeves, but the shirt, it's kind of bouncy. It's got a pretty nice, I like this material. When I first touched it, I was like, oh, it doesn't feel that soft. But when I put it on, I do like the, the material. Again, it's pretty stretchy. It reminds me of the rolled up muscle tee, which is one of my favorites for, I guess, going out or outside of the gym activities, because I feel like that one just looks nice. So this one's pretty similar to that, so this is probably something I would wear um, after the gym, going around uh, as like a, like a t-shirt. Um, so these training tights, uh, this is the blue color. Um, very, I mean, of course, they're tight, so they're super stretchy, super free, um, and overall pretty solid and a pretty cool waistband that they've got. So the Alpha Elite there. So these two have already dropped, so they're on the website already. Um, next, and also with the training tight, they do have shorts, so this is kind of like the pants. I don't know if it's just, I think, maybe it's the outfit because I think it's closer to their fall release. They just feel really warm, so it's already like pretty hot in here. And they've also got the training shorts, so got them in white, same waistband, and you can see how stretchy they are, so solid there. Um, I think they've got some other colors too, because um, these are training shorts. Um, depending on your gym situation, you'll know if uh, a lot of people wear like these training shorts under stuff or if they wear them as their complete shorts, So I know some people do. Um, so now I'm going to get into the next thing. So next up, we got the Premier Performance hoodie. So it's another one of their hoodies, very similar to the other ones that have dropped. Very soft on the inside, feels comfortable. I think it's more of a relaxed fit. Give you a little 360 with this. Um, and go with the pants for now. but. Hoodie, I got an XL. I usually size up for hoodies. Um, I like them to be a little bit baggy in most cases. Um, and I'm someone who likes, I mean, I live in New Jersey, so it's very cold. So when I get to the gym, I'm usually gonna be wearing some kind of hoodie um, or long sleeve even in like the summer, spring, or like warmer months, just cause I like, that helps me get warm, get a nice little pump or a little sweat going, get some blood flow to the joints so I'm not so achy coming into the gym. So this is usually what I wear coming in. But very, very comfortable, can never go wrong with hoodies. Um, and it's pretty much a similar to what they've dropped in the past for Alpha Elite. Very soft on the inside. I think it's a relaxed fit. You got the Alpha Elite across, you got the drawstrings, 
And now what we're going to be getting into is, I believe, the big things for this launch. I think this hoodie hasn't launched yet. I think this comes out Saturday. But now we're going to get into the, so we have the premium joggers and then really like cool stuff that I think pretty innovative that they haven't dropped in the past. We're going to have pullover and we're going to have a zip up. And um, as far as sizing goes for everything I've gone over so far, um, this is the only XL. Everything else has been large. So the training tights went with... I got a large, and uh, I probably would have gone XL if I uh, had the choice, but I think the large fits correctly, so I think I'm pretty happy with that. On um, the shirts, I always wear large, like that snug fit, um, and uh, as you can see, I wore the other color now of these shirts, uh, the collective tees, and navy blue is one of my favorite kind of shirt colors to wear, um, that and black shirts, because dark colors tend to be a little slimming, so then around the arms helps it pop, so if you want to add an inch to your arms, tight black t-shirt, tight navy blue t-shirt, helps your arms pop a little bit. So this is uh, probably one of my favorite shirts, Collective C, so I like this one, I'm gonna wear it a lot. Um, but we're gonna be getting into the premium joggers, and so I think this would technically be premium joggers V3.0, but these are called the premium pro elite joggers. Premium pro elite. Um, so I have a pair on, but I'll walk you through kind of I mean, some of the changes, um, they're pretty, I mean, a little different, and I think there's a lot of innovations and probably things that are over my knowledge of clothes. Um, so right here, around the cuff of the, the what is that, an ankle, um, so half of it is this kind of, this stretch, a little bit thicker, whatever that is called with that texture. The other half is just kind of more the material of the jogger. Um, you got the learn more, dream more, be more down the side, and it's kind of this reflective uh, kind of print, which that's a change, and I really like that because they also changed that. Because um, I think I had an issue, and some people had an issue with like the previous more of the 3D. Sometimes it may peel off after many, many wears. Um, this is that reflective, and it's kind of printed onto it, so this will probably stick around uh, for a longer time. Um, waistband is pretty much the same. You got your two back pockets. Um, very, very stretchy. These are ridiculously stretchy, so <laughs> very stretch. Um, so you could probably even be squatting in these. Um, and besides that, you got your zipper pockets, which I'll show you when I'm when I have them on. Zipper pockets on the side, back pockets. You got the reflective on the front, um, and they have changed, which is also going to be on the pullover and the zip up. Um, this kind of um, I guess you would call this around the, the cuff or something, or around the ankle. They also have that around the wrist on the pullovers. So I'm going to put on one of the pullovers. Um, and then I'll show you the joggers as well, which I kind of already showed you. All right, so here is the pullover, and this is a large, so it's going to be a little bit more fitted for me. Would I go XL? I mean, I like kind of the fitted look of them, of the pullover, so I don't know if I would size up. Maybe it's up to you. I'm 225, so maybe if you're 220, 230, XL, or maybe go large if you like it, like me a little bit fitted. So... Here is that, the pullover. We got, this is the fit of the joggers, the premiums, very stretchy. Right, Elon? Right, buddy? Right, buddy? Right, buddy? All right, he freaked out as I like, touched him. I got smacked. Uh, so here's the fit, and the back, and that's that. You also got these, it goes all the way through. So you got this front, I think it's called kangaroo pouch. Um, but yes, this is the pullover. It's got the reflective, uh, Lauren Moore, Dream More, Be More, um, 1502. Also reflective, and again, it has that same kind of end that's on the ankle, that same kind of, um, I guess, that cuff. So this kind of brings the stretch a little bit more. Um, so a little bit snug. Again, it's an, uh, a large. When this stuff was coming in, I was like, oh, I got a large for a lot of like the pullovers, the zip ups, and usually for hoodies, I go XL. So I was a little bit nervous if things were gonna fit. Um, also, all these premium joggers, I'm doing. I'm also wearing a large. The premiums, I always go large in joggers, and pretty much all the other joggers, I size up to an XL. So these ones, I mean, it's up to you. Again, for me, um, legs are kind of my strong suit, and I still go with the the large. Um, they have a good stretch, and I mean, if you think that they look stupid on me, size up. If you like the way they look on me, um, then you may want to size down from the other joggers um, if that's the fit you're going for. But they do have the stretch, so if you like that fitted look, these are the ones to do it with. Um, and then, of course, 
Um, the pullover, similar fabric, good amount of stretch. Um, I think it looks very classy, but this is the pullover. So the benefit of the pullover is it's not a zip all the way down. You got this zip up to here. Again, it's a large, it's a little bit tight on my neck. Um, so keep that open a little bit. But the benefit is this only goes down to here, the zipper. And then you got that full kangaroo pouch that you can fully be relaxing here. But you can't be zipping it down and just fully taking it off. So let me show you. So I can show you this. Um, again, this is the pullover. So it also has the Alpha Elite, a lot of paneling on the back. And yeah, I mean, here's what it looks like when I'm not wearing it. But they also have the navy, uh, navy blue that they sent over. So really cool stuff, especially for fall in Jersey. This would be something nice to wear over like a t-shirt or something. Um, for me, I'm not sure if this is like my training type gear. I mean, if you're a runner, I think this is exactly up your alley. Um, but in terms of strength training, I prefer hoodies. But if I'm going out trying to trying to look good, trying to look classy, I'll probably be wearing these to places. So next up, I'm going to show you guys what the zip up looks like. And honestly, yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's my favorite fit um, of like all the things dropping. <laughs> I put it on uh, yesterday, and I told Nicole, I was like. I feel expensive, so I'll show you what that is. All right, guys. So next up, we got the Premium Pro Elite jacket, and this is, I think, the white color. This one is dangerous. So for me, especially, um, it's a very like a bright white, very clean. So it's very <laughs> easy to get stained. So for me, wearing this, I got to be very strategic because I don't want to get a stain on it. But really, really nice look. Um, I wore this yesterday and Nicole took a picture, I was like, damn, I feel expensive, uh, just because it's a very, very clean look. So I'll show you what this one looks like. Um, standing up, also got the black joggers on. Uh, so here that is. So the thing with the full zip up, uh, the thing you sacrifice is you don't have that full pouch all the way across. So you do have the pockets here. Um, but I'll give you the 360 with it. Do, do, do. And so that is the large. So probably with the with the zip up, I think XL for me is probably going to be the move, um, just because it's easier to zip on, zip off, um, and you can wear it like a little looser. So benefit of the jacket, you can fully zip down um, and be relaxed. So I really really like this this color. I mean for me though, I am someone who gets all my clothes stained somehow. I'm like a little kid, um, so got to be strategic with that. But um, also didn't show you guys the premium joggers, the zipper, so the zip's pretty solid, um, and pretty deep pocket, actually really deep pockets, so it goes all the way down to there. Um, so we got the jacket in the white, and then we got this kind of, I guess, uh, this is like a more of a teal kind of colorway. Uh, they have the reflective, again, alpha lead there, so really nice, catches the light on the back as well catches the light very nicely. Um, these have a nice fit to them um, as well. Same thing with the, the uh, around the wrists. They have kind of that textured material or textured kind of thing that's really stretchy. And then of course it just has the material all the way to the end. So I, I really like that. I think it has a nice stretch to it. I like how these are like pretty fitted. Again, this is a large. Um, I'm probably between sizes on these. Could go either way, um, depending on the fit that you were going for that I'm going for as well. Um, but yeah, this one really like. I think it's a yeah, really classy look. Reminds me of like the Lululemon kind of stuff. Um, but I think Alpha Leaf really does bring like high quality stuff. So I'm really really liking it all. But that is pretty much gonna do it for this haul. So the things dropping this weekend, I think is the the Premium Pro Elite line. So you have the jacket. You have plenty of joggers. Another color of joggers I did not go through. We got the hunter color, so it's kind of going to be that green as well. So a green one, got the red, there's a navy blue, um, which I believe is called carbon. And then we have the black color as well. So I like the premium joggers. They have that kind of really good stretch. I mean, the essential joggers are also a really nice comfy pair. These ones I think are pretty good for like performance because um, I feel like they're probably a little bit more durable as well. Um, and then, of course, we have the Collective Tees. I think it's a good going out kind of shirt. Um, and then we have the pullover for the Premium Pro Elite. Um, so it depends what you what you like to wear, if you like the kind of halfway zip and the full pouch, or if you like the full zip off. Personally, I like the full zip off, because I think it's like, if it starts getting hot, you can zip it down, and then if it gets like really warm, you can just fully take it off. So I think that's easier 
than the pullover. So up to you how you handle that. But those are the three things, mainly I think dropping Saturday. And then already, again, the collective tee, we have the training tights and the training shorts. Um, and there's also an Alpha Leap mask that they have released as well. I have that downstairs and uh, it's a black mask. So that, and we have the hoodie as well. So I think that's the majority of the things that are gonna be dropping, again, in terms of sizing, which I think that these videos are always helpful for, and probably the reason I love Alpha Leap so much, and uh, uh, why this has been a goal for me to be able to work with them, is, um, I mean, for me, I'm 6'2", uh, again, 225. So for me, when I wear like a large or an XL in like non-fitness brands, um, it's usually gonna be a box. <laughs> They're not really gonna have that taper. So that's what I like about wearing like kind of athletic based companies. So Alpha Leap, usually it's gonna be tapered in so it's gonna hug your waist a little bit better. Show off that V taper, but when you kind of get like regular stuff, it's gonna be a box. And the XL is large, just gets large. XL just keeps getting wider, but at least this kind of still has that form fitting kind of factor. So that's why I like that. And also shout out to you guys, and I'm very thankful for you guys um, very much uh, that Alphalete's extended, uh, having me on the team for another six months. So hopefully I don't mess that up. Um, but I've been extended from the three months to another six months, and we'll see if we do like, I think a yearly or something. So again, thank you guys for using my code. Apparently have uh, referred some people over. It's been beneficial for both parties. And I'm super happy because I get to wear their stuff even more when I was already wearing it pretty much every day. Um, so there's that. Uh, so yeah, if you have any questions, drop those down below. Nicole is going to edit this up. I'm going to stop rambling. If you decide to pick anything up, use my referral code, um, and that would be super awesome. Um, if this also helps you with picking out your size, let me know down below as well because I used to watch these all the time to kind of figure out what size I should get. Um, so, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, large and everything except the hoodie, and I think uh, most things fit pretty much correctly. Maybe the jacket I would size up. Uh, maybe the pullover too. The pullover I'll just keep uh, at the same size actually, but this, the jacket maybe size to XL. So up to you. Again, it's all about your preference. But thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. The launch will be Saturday, 10 a.m. CST, which is 11 a.m. EST um, time zones. But I'll see you guys next time. Keep it flexible. I'm out.